do we have enough technology now? Depends on what you want to do. Do we have enough technology to get to 20% uh, uh, of 1990 emissions by 2050? Absolutely not. We simply don't. There are holes in it. Uh, can we get to 50% uh, below 1990? Probably. I said earlier when we were talking about government policy that I'm an incrementalist. And I think what we should do is we should be deploying the technology now that is going to help us get on the way to where we want to go. And as new technology comes in, we should deploy that to get us further along the road. Uh, remember Richter's second law, uh, that no matter how good something is, someone's going to demand we wait for something better. And the people who don't want to deploy the things we have now that are effective are examples of Richter's second law. We can't wait. It takes a long time to change the whole energy system of a country. And we better start. Uh, it's, what, $2 trillion out of $14 trillion out of our economy? To make a change like that, we're not going to change it in five or 10 years. Does it matter what Al Gore says? It's not going to happen. So let's start with the stuff we can do. Let's start incentivizing the things that will get us on the way. And let's keep going on the R&D for the things we need to get us all the way.